Murder trial in DeKalb County may come down to what happened in less than 10 seconds. Ex DeKalb police officer Robert Olson is accused of killing a naked and unarmed veteran. CBS 46's Ashley Thompson was in court as prosecutors and the defense gave jurors a glimpse at what's ahead. A jury of seven women and five men were seated this morning. They heard from several witnesses who laid out exactly what happened on March 9th, 2015. Carolyn Jumo told the jury her 26 year old son, Anthony Hill, was struggling with mental illness when he was shot and killed in 2015. Was he diagnosed with any mental illnesses while serving in the Air Force? Yes, PTSD and bipolar. Hill was shot to death by former DeKalb County police officer Robert Chip Olson, who responded to several 911 calls about the Air Force veteran who was naked and acting erratically at a Shambly apartment complex. This case boils down to all of about six or seven seconds that Chip Olson had to react. Defense attorney Don Samuel says Olson had no choice but to open fire when Hill began moving toward him, refusing to listen to commands. He pulls out the gun with his left hand and he points and he yells, stop, stop. And he doesn't stop. Prosecutors say Hill was unarmed in the midst of a mental episode and shouldn't have been shot. His arms were by his side, his hands were visible, he was stark naked. He had no clothes on, nowhere to hide a weapon, no weapon in his hand. The jury saw videos of Hill before the shooting, naked, at times crawling on the ground and swinging from a balcony. Several witnesses, including the apartment manager who called 911, were called to testify. I went from there, I was like, why did you shoot him? We shot him. So I was, it was not my intention for him to be shot. The trial continues tomorrow here at the DeKalb County Courthouse. In DeKalb County, I'm Ashley Thompson, CBS 46 News. Ashley.